from the Cruise Radio Studio in Jacksonville, Florida. This is Cruise Radio News with Doug Parker. Here's your Cruise News Briefs for Monday, April 5th, 2021. The CDC has finally released the second phase of its Framework for Conditional Sailing Order. The phase will involve the cruise lines establishing individual agreements at ports where they intend to operate and developing plans for vaccination strategies. The CDC is recommending that lines require vaccinations for all crew and passengers, but it doesn't appear that it will be an official requirement as of now. Notably absent from Phase 2 are the simulated test sailings that the CDC previously said the lines would have to conduct with volunteer passengers on each vessel. The agency said those will be part of Phase 3. For now, if you want to sail this summer, you'll need to fly to Nassau, Bermuda, St. Martin, Cyprus, over in Europe. Just make sure you have a passport and are vaccinated. And in a recent video from Carnival Cruise Line, the company's president, Christine Duffy, toured the line's brand new Terminal 3 at Port Canaveral. Construction on T3 was completed last year, and it awaits in anticipation of the launch of Mardi Gras, Carnival's largest ship to date. For those of you who do not know him, Captain John Murray, he's the CEO of Port Canaveral, and I am standing with him in our amazing, beautiful new terminal. The video goes on to show a terminal filled with wooden furniture and white accents coupled with palm trees to get guests in the Caribbean spirit. And Celebrity Cruise's new ship, Celebrity Beyond, has successfully completed her first float out. This means that the framework and exterior are nearing completion and that her interior work can now begin. Celebrity Beyond will be the third Edge class ship following Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex and is set to debut in 2022. And the stock market was closed on Friday in observance for Good Friday and is set to reopen later on this morning. You can find breaking news and up-to-the-minute industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise Radio News. Thanks for being here. The proceeding was a production of Cruise Radio. For more accurate and dependable updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.